Hello Explorers, it's good to see you. Hello Explorers, it's good to see you too. We were hiding from you. <laughs> we were hiding and speaking. How did you know it was us? I think our voices sound special and unique. They don't need to see us to know we were there. That reminds me of another element of music. Tom or timbre is the quality of a sound. It makes each sound sound unique. We all have different sounding voices that make us sound different from one another. Right, Barnaby? Instruments also have unique sounds that make each of them sound different. That's why we can hear the piano sound different from a harp sound or a cymbal sound or a violin sound. Interesting! Identify the instruments being played. It's a Good job, Barnaby. Here's the next one. It's electric guitar. That's right, Barnaby. The drum set. You're great at this game. My favorite, the piano. You're correct, Barnaby. Here's the last one. That's correct. <laughs> That's all great, but how can I describe the sound quality of instruments? Here are some simple examples. We can say that a sound is soft, loud, high, low, noisy, or melodious, which means it sounds very calm and soothing. We are using words to describe the sounds of instruments. Get ready for a tongue challenge! <laughs> Listen to the flute. Select the correct answer. Does the flute sound high or low? The tone is definitely high. Listen to the harp sound. Does it sound loud or soft? Listen to the electric guitar. Is the tom of the electric guitar soft or noisy? It's definitely noisy. Listen to the <laughs> piano. It definitely sounds loud. Listen to the saxophone. Is the tom of the saxophone soft or melodious? Playtime! Let's use our imagination to go on a jungle hunt! <laughs> Sing along with the melody. Play the instrument that matches the tone or timbre of each jungle animal's sound. Take a look at the instruments.
with your voice. Well done, explorers! I hope you learned a lot about Tom or Tomber today. If you'd like to continue exploring this element, check out the Explorers Print and Go worksheet in the description box below. See you next time! Don't forget!